the way they will be. And they're at risk for serious conditions like diabetes, cancer, heart disease, that undermine their health, that diminish their prospects, and they cost our economy billions of dollars each year. But the story of Let's Move is also the story of individuals and organizations from every sector of our society who have stepped forward to meet this challenge. It's the story of, of food manufacturers who pledged to cut 1.5 trillion calories from their products. Uh, companies like Boya Foods that are giving our families the information they need to make healthy choices about what they eat. Local grocers and, and national chains like Walgreens, Super Value, they're building new supermarkets and selling fresh food in 1,500 underserved communities in this country. Their kids' menus, loading them with healthier options. Our mayors out there across the country, they're planting gardens, they're refurbishing parks. Congress passed historic legislation to provide healthier school meals for millions of our children. More than 3,400 professional chefs have signed up to help local schools improve their menus. And then there are our celebrities, everyone from Beyonce to LeBron to Drew Brees are serving as role models, inspiring our kids to dance, dribble, and cast their way to a healthier life. And it's important to know that, that all these folks are doing these things not just as business leaders who are concerned about their bottom line, not just as elected officials serving their constituents or as celebrities promoting a cause. They're doing this as parents and grandparents who care about our nation's children. They're doing it as citizens who know that we as a country cannot fulfill our promise unless our children can fulfill their promise.